guys, today I'm going to be showing you what happens to Joy-Cons when they die. Now, if you have a Joy-Con that doesn't turn on anymore, that means it's clearly dead. As you can really tell. But, if you have another Joy-Con that's alive, then what we have to do when the other one dies? Like, however you want to control it. So. Well, let me go ahead and go to sync right now. Well, if it's like that mode, then you're going to have to start controlling like this until you get to the uh, until until you get to controllers setting. Hold on, you're going to, you're going to use the smooth, you're going to press this to accept, and you're going to keep going to controllers, and then oh, after that, you're going to go to control, and, and you want to go to sync controllers. Once you do that, you want to you want to, you want to make sure it turns off. And then sync it like this. Make sure I do that. And once you do that, you are going to accept. And you're going to play with it like this. For now on. Until you get your dead in charge. charge. Well, guys, I, guys, I'm just going to show you this just because some people are afraid to, to let their controller die. Because they won't be able to play anymore. Well, I let my controller sit overnight just for this video. So, you're welcome. Bye.